Hello again viewers, there is the explosive bag and the pound shop glasses. <laughs> Incredible value, I don't know how they can do it. This hotel, wait to hear the price. Look at this, a wee side sea view, how nice is that? They've got a wee roof terrace there, a couple of people out sunbathing, table tennis. Uh, swimming pool is downstairs as well. We're in the Hotel Monopole in Porto de la Cruz, which I believe this is possibly one of the first ever hotels in Tenerife when tourism began. I've stayed here before, you might have seen my previous video. I had to disconnect the TV to plug in my power bank. I could only find one socket in the room. Can't complain about it. Um, it's a two-star hotel. It's very basic, old-fashioned, but it's got charm. And there's the wee tapas menu of yours. Let's see. Yeah, okay, they get cakes and stuff as well, all sorts going on in there. Another wee side view out here, I don't want to put the phone out the window too much, in case it falls. Uh, wee side sea view, there I had to disconnect the TV, so I don't know what channels it's got, probably Spanish ones, more of a Spanish feel this place. Um, so we're in room 217, it's a single room. A couple of things to bear in mind if you're coming here, it's a very, very basic hotel, but it has got complete charm and character. That's the room key, I'm just going to take that out now. Oh, I'll show you the bathroom, I forgot to show you the bathroom. <laughs> um, watch till the end, I'll show you exactly where it's located if you've not seen my previous video. The bathroom's been done up, it's quite, quite nice actually. Um, so, recently been done up. Hello viewers, how you doing? Um, hair dryer. Not, I did find this socket, but it's too high up for me to plug power banks and stuff and I need to get something to rest it on. Um, so the bathroom really no complaints, it's quite nice. It's just got character Porto del Cruz, I really like it. It's a pity it's so far away in the bus, took an hour and 50 minutes from Los Cristianos, which is a shame. Let's head out viewers and I'll show you exactly where it is. Take the room key with me. Now, it could go down these stairs, but let me show you the communal area around here, because even, even the communal area in this hotel has got character. Hello again, viewers. <laughs> um, check it out. I'll tell you in a wee minute how much I paid for this. I booked it through ebookers.com. I've actually found a few deals with ebookers.com recently. They get a very similar interface to Hotels.com, I don't even know if they're part of the same company, but um, worth checking them out. If you sign up as a member, it's free, and they'll sometimes give you what they call insider prices. To be fair, this hotel was more or less the same price with most companies, two or three pound of a difference. Let's go down the stairs. It's bed and breakfast. Breakfast is a kind of Spanish-style breakfast, because I've been here before, so it's not a full English breakfast or anything like that, but to get breakfast for the price is incredible value. Um, I don't even know if I'll have a breakfast. I'll film it for you. I've done it, done it last time. I'll see if it's any different. Here's the reception area, which is beautiful, I think. Um, there's pictures on the wall of various people who have owned the hotel. So it's got, it's got a lot of history. There's a wee library around the corner here. Oh, I went round the wrong way to go down the stairs. We wait till you see the best part of the hotel, where it's located, I'll, I'll walk out and I'll show you right on the seafront. So, we library here, probably people who have left books. Different languages as well, it's not just, um, it's not just in English. We've got some history of the hotel up there, there's a lot of pictures and stuff downstairs. Location wise, it's probably a 10 minute walk from the bus station when you get the bus to Porto de la Cruz. Um, if you're coming from Los Cris, even for a day, or you're going to stay, go back the next day, you can get an unlimited card for 10 euros. It'll work out cheaper for you if you're going to come back within 24 hours. So, for example, let's say you leave Los Cris at 12 o'clock, then you want to leave here just before 12 to use your card the next day. It won't cost you anything. They've got lifts in the hotel, um, any mobility problems. 
So this is the reception area. The pool is through here. I'll quickly show you the pool. Somebody just coming out. Restaurant is down the stairs. That's where breakfast is, down the stairs. And I'll show you outside in a minute. Wait till you see the pool and I'll tell you how much I paid for this tonight. You won't believe it. A wee bar here, I've never seen it open. So, what about that? A pool with a view. Fantastic. And I've been in the pool, the pool's hot as well. Um, beautiful, eh? Obviously there's a wee bit of fishing history on Porto de la Cruz as well. Let's head out. I'll show you the location, exactly where it's close to. Reception is just on the left. Staff are very friendly here, this is the second time here. First thing they say to me is you've stayed here before, haven't you? I says, yep. So, here we go, viewers. So we can go down that way. More of like an old town feel down there. But they've got a lot of shops down there. If you like shopping, different shops. They've got a lot of tapas restaurants. The harbour's just down the right-hand side. There's a, there's a great wee bar for live music late at night called, I think it's Molly Malone's. Well, wait till you see the views here. So, I paid £28 for bed and breakfast. Incredible value. £28. Um, depending on the night you're staying, you can actually, I've seen it even £25, £26. Um, obviously, depending on when you come, maybe a bit more. I was speaking to the guy at the section, he was saying that the hotel was actually fully booked. So, it's a popular hotel, and no wonder when you see when you see the views here, where you're located, and the money you're paying, it's unbelievable value. Oh, hot viewers. 32 degrees. Um, I'm just going to show you the views here, they're amazing. If you're new to the channel, don't forget, it doesn't cost anything, absolutely free. Hit the wee subscribe button um, and join the wee community on YouTube. Wait till you see the views here. What about that viewers? Check these guys out. Swimming. Wow. That looks far too choppy for me to even consider swimming in. They must be really strong, good swimmers. But can't you beat it for location? I mean fantastic. Brilliant eh? You go down that way to the harbour as well. So basically there is the hotel. It's dead easy to find, you come to Port de la Cruz, you just basically walk down the promenade area and you'll find it right at the end. They've got a wee underground restaurant here. Pomodoro, I think it's called. You go down the steps, we'll see if it's open, I can show you, but I don't think it's open now. Ah, oh, that's a few people in. Stretches down the side. But, Incredible value, amazing value actually, um, for the money. It's the value for money you get when you come up north compared to the south, you just can't compare. And the history here, it's where tourism began. So, can't complain, Yes, can't complain. Thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed the wee room tour. Um, not bad for £28. Eh? I'll be back to reality when I go back to Las Americas in a few days time, I'll be paying double, triple that maybe, we'll see, we'll see, we'll see what we can find viewers, um, it's goodbye from beautiful Porta de la Cruz, I'll see you in the next one.